Ice baby. But he found himself out in the cold after turning to drugs and then trying to commit suicide. I turned to, uh, you know, drugs as an escape route. Uh, everything from heroin to cocaine to ecstasy, uh, all of it, you know. And I tried to commit suicide in 94 with all the money in the world. One day I found myself on the, on the floor, my friends dumping buckets of cold water on me. I wrote a suicide note and I was ready to go. Vanilla Ice had it all back in the early 90s. His single Ice Ice Baby sold 17 million copies. He never dreamed of such success. On a dare, he'd gotten up in a Miami club and rap. That led to a small recording contract. Within three years, he had a major record deal and millions of screaming fans. Well, I bought my green car, Porsches, and mansions. L.A. to Miami and in between and, uh, you know, yachts and everything. Five months ago, I was so broke, I didn't, I, I, my car was getting repossessed. I had nothing, man. There were even headlines screaming he wasn't from the street, that he was from a comfortable suburban home, but it came to us to set the record straight. I am from the streets, that's where I learned to rap. He even claims he had a relationship with Madonna, which was of the two together, ended up in her infamous sex book. I had a fling, you know, and uh, with her. Uh, it lasted for about eight months or so, and uh, I didn't know she was, you know, she took a lot of pictures. With, you know, always pictures, you know, I'm used to that. I don't know what half the pictures are going to be used for it. And I see this hard copy sex book, you know, uh, aluminum cover, $100 for a sex book, and I'm like, I open it up and I look in it and I'm just blown away. I didn't want to be a part of the slutty package, you know. I mean, my friends all thought it was cool, but me, I just didn't want to be, you know, I knew her and I knew that wasn't real and I didn't want to be a part of it, so it kind of turned me off on that whole deal. When a follow-up album and a feature film both fizzled, Vanilla Ice's career melted away, and though he kept his riches, he got caught up in a whirlwind of drug abuse. I had a weekend that lasted eight months, okay? <laughs> I didn't know which way I was going, right, left. I mean, I was, I was up all the time, excuse me. And on that night in 1994, he tried to end it all. It didn't work. I took enough drugs to kill an army. And, um, you know, I woke up a couple days later and I was like, I'm still here. I kind of pinched myself and I was like, wow. He decided to begin again and shed his old lifestyle. But first, he tried to use prescription drugs to cure himself. I was very lonely, very depressed. Taking every drug from Adderall to Ritalin to... Xanax to uh, whatever and you know to try to fix myself and I realized you know none of this is uh, actually working. What turned things around was his marriage to Laura Jarita with whom he now has two daughters Dusty Rain and Keely Breed. Oh. He's also on tour to back up his new CD Bipolar with much more hard-hitting music than his Ice Ice days. And his older daughter has already expressed an interest in music herself. They have a little studio in her room, because I have a big studio, and I didn't want to come in there and push some buttons and everything in my studio, so I got her little studio. She got a miniature drum kit, miniature keyboards, microphones, karaoke machines, and she just goes off, man. In January of 2001, Vanilla Ice was arrested after a domestic dispute and spent a night in jail. Immediately, he and his wife came to E.T. to say it was all a misunderstanding. It's the heated argument, started yelling at each other, and it, it just escalated, and it's not any big deal. It was blown a lot out of proportion, and I, I don't want him to be made out to be like some wife abuser. He would never hit me. He now says he has his life on track in all areas, and he isn't hiding behind a new name. I'm Vanilla Ice, and I will always be. Vanilla Ice, whose real name is Roz Van Winkle, also loves motocross and participates in celebrity races all across the country.